My name is Nestor Brito, Senior Applications Instructor for Technical Prospects, and today's tech tips, we're going to talk about radial scanning for the liver. So today we're going to talk about radial scanning for MRCP liver. I'm going to start off obviously with a few pre-scans before we start this. Hold your breath. Breathe. I like to do a little prep scanning before I actually do my radials. And one, one particular sequence I like to write is a hat, haste sequence, multi-slice, right over where you would probably think that the biliary tree would be at. Again, hold your breath. Next, I personally like to run a sagittal, single shot, single slice haste. Why? Because your biliary tree typically sagittally has an angle anteriorly. And if you run a straight coronal through that sagittal, the coronal is not going to get the biliary tree all looking nice like a, like a normal tree would look like. A lot of people don't run this particular sagittals. I like to run it. So this little dot right here is what I'm shooting for. That's probably the entrance of the biliary tree where the gallbladder exits into the biliary tree. Again, hold your breath. And here it is. See how nicely, I'm gonna go ahead and close this protocol out. See how nicely the sagittal biliary tree looks. It's nice and on a sagittal view. Now I'm not going to run this particular next sequence, but most people will have an angled biliary tree and it'll typically angle forward. And then if you angle your coronal forward along with the biliary tree, you will get a very nice looking coronal biliary tree. And you'll typically get one good slice right through the whole thing. Now I'm not gonna run this particular sequence for this tech tip. I'm gonna go ahead straight to the radial slices. Open up the sequence, position your one slice over the biliary tree again, that little white dot. And then we're gonna come up here and we're gonna go to add on, create radial slices, select readout, because I'm on an axial image and you want readout for an axial image. I'm gonna choose, select five slices, and here are my radial five slices all being centered over the biliary tree. One last thing you wanna do is go to your physio tab, your pace tab. You wanna make sure breath hold is turned on and however many slices you selected, that is how many concatenations you want. So I chose five slices, I'm gonna select five concatenations. I'm gonna hit apply.
And this time we're gonna use the breath hold button here in the scan area. This little button here is what we're gonna use because we turned on breath hold instead of the other type of breath hold. We always have two types of breath holds. So this is the one that we're gonna be using for this. Okay, go ahead and take in a breath and hold it. And I'm gonna be doing this five times and you're gonna see this biliary tree turning in a circle. Taking a breathe, taking another breath and hold it. 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 And breathe. And here are our radial slices going around in a complete 360 degrees five slices. The important part to remember is that when you do this is that you go to physio, paste tab, select your breath hold and select your concatenations to match your slices. A lot of people forget this and then you're not gonna be able to do this radially. And for more tech tips like these, go to technicalprospects.com and click on that resources tab.